Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. There is a lot of time and effort and pain that goes into opening a Titan Crystal. Full transparency disclosure of my account. I have kind of a measly 200, 1,750 Battleground solo event points. I, um, I'm probably gonna make a harder push toward the end. But right now, that is what I have going for me. And that is not close, of course, to get that top milestone of Titan Crystal Shard. And so, this is something that you just spend so much time working toward, and for several people, 450,000 points is so much, especially if you don't point farm, that it's just a ton of stress, a ton of pressure to open a crystal. And so it is a big, big, big deal to open a Titan Crystal. And to be fair, that's exactly what Kabam wanted the experience to be like. They were very upfront about why they wanted the Titan Crystal to be an event, as they called it. Not just because it's 20,000 Crystal Shards of a price, but because everybody in it was supposed to be somebody who was really exciting or at least... Uh, good. So, out of all the champions in this, the ones that I would want the least, Jabari Panther for sure. Uh, OG Iron Man some people love, but I just feel like is, for my purposes, more mid than exciting. And again, there are certain paths of like Alliance Quest or Alliance War that I have seen OG Iron Man thrive in. And I have featured a couple of those videos in this channel. So I'm not saying he doesn't have some amazing utility and that people who love him can't get a lot out of him. But for my personal enjoyment, he is not somebody that I care about. So with that being said, my man Scott Buster, longtime supporter of the channel, reached out because he had his first ever Titan Crystal and wanted to share the results. And so, yes, 450,000 solo event points. Uru 1 is where he currently is. What a boss. So much work that goes into this. 22,200 Titan Crystal Shards. Pretty impressive. Really, anybody but Jabari, Panther, Slash Parker, and OG Iron Man. Oh, Kindred would be amazing. So what have you? No, no. Oh my God! I fell out of my chair. That's disgusting. That is, that is disgusting. I'm trying to pause it from my chair. I fell out of my chair, my friend. I'm so sorry. Look, I'm not saying that they're not a champion that has some value, but what? No! I fell out of the chair in disgust. This is the kind of thing that makes you want to quit. So much time and effort over so many different game modes to get those Titan Shards, and that's what they, the game gives you? I think he sent a follow-up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that's not a follow-up. That's an expression of yeah. <laughs> Total sadness. I I'm not going to make him relive it. It's already PTSD, but like. There are just so many good champions in that crystal. I would feel absolutely cursed if I was Scott Buster. Absolutely cursed. Would you quit the game after this? Because I think you might be tempted to. I mean, I'm sort of playing tongue-in-cheek because he's got so much money invested in the game he can't really walk away. But he also feels the burnout. And this is why people are so burnt out. This is why people are so burnt out. Because you spend all this time and effort opening up a crystal that's obviously not a nexus. And then you probably get the one champion that you say, well, I'll be fine as long as I don't get X, Y, and Z. And that's happened to me a lot in the six-star feature crystal. But the stakes are pretty low for that, you know? This, not so much. This, the stakes couldn't really be higher. It's If it's an event... It's like you host yourself a birthday party and nobody shows up and the cake is stale. Oh, 
All right, you Jabari Panther fans, please make this guy feel better about himself because I can't do it. I, I now regret saying all the horrible things about Jabari Panther because it feels kind of like I'm piling on, but I don't watch the Crystal opening beforehand because I want my first reaction to be not an act. I want it to be organic. I think that's part of why this video series has been as popular as it has been on my channel for six years. But this is this is in the Hall of Shame. There's a Hall of Fame. This is the Hall of Shame of like worst pain I've ever seen. Ouch. Thank you for the support of this in-pain summoner.